Prince Noctis! Welcome back. Your story came to a happy end. <laughs> well, well. We owe you, Talcott. You're welcome. Splendid. You've done well, my boy. Not unlike you and your father when you were little. Hmm. You think so? Yeah. <sighs> Not again. What's the matter? You all right? He'll be fine, don't worry. But we ought to take a closer look at this so-called disc. Then look no further than the Outlook. We can use the viewer things. No substitute for being on site, but it would be a start. Let's see what we can glean of Nock's condition. You have a headache? I hope you feel better soon, Prince Noctis. Hmm, perhaps you ought to rest a while. Are you sure you're okay? This looks awesome. Dude! Oh, this is gonna be a party in my mouth. I dare say I can recreate this. What a coincidence. I'm not so sure it is. Aren't nursery rhymes curious things? Like this one. From the deep, the Archean calls. Yet on deaf ears the god's tongue falls. The king made to kneel in pain, he crawls. So how do we keep him on his feet? You need only heed the call. Visit the Archean and hear his plea. I can take you. We in? I don't know. We take a ride. But watch our backs. Fair enough. Let's do it. I'm not one to stand on ceremony, but such an occasion calls for an introduction. Please, call me Arden. Come with me to the car park. That's where I left my automobile. She's a dear old thing. Pales next to your regalia, but she's never let me down. So, we take two vehicles, a convoy of sorts, shall we? Huh.
All set. Very well. Let me... When you are ready. All set. Allow me to do the honor of assigning your driver. I choose you. Fine by me. You drive your car and I drive mine. With that decided, let us be off. Just to be clear, this isn't a race, it is a chase. You're not to pass me. Lose sight of me, and you'll lose your way. And no tailgating. An accident would spoil the trip. All right, all right. Let's hit the road already. As you wish. Drive safely now. First Galden and then Lestalem. What a coincidence, huh? Way too convenient to be a coincidence. I reckon he's following us around. But to what end? That question bothers me deeply, as does his origin. It's hard for me to picture that guy in the Empire. But it's even harder to imagine him as a Lucian. I'd sooner not rely on him. But he may be our only way in to the Disk of Kothis. What's his highness's opinion of this, Arden? <sighs> Don't really have one. He's nothing more than a creepy old dude to me. <laughs> you hit the nail on the head right there. Well, that's why we came up with a plan. Gotta watch our backs the whole way. Knocked. How are the headaches? Fine for now, but they come without warning. Wouldn't want to have one behind the wheel. Stop if you need to, all right? So, any havens along the way? Oh, somebody wants to camp. Somebody else wants a proper bed. Nice firm ground's much better for your back. Can't we at least make it a caravan? I don't get why you like camping so much. Under the stars, at one with nature. What's not to like? Now in the wild, there are no rules to follow. No checkout time. I dare say you had knocked with no checkout time. I'm all for extra sleep. Not saying it's easy, but I envy the hunters. Wish I could live like that. That makes one of us, big guy. What say we call it a day here? What say we continue on to Carthus? The Archeum's not going anywhere. Neither are we under your stewardship. So we make camp with Arden. Hell no. <sighs> Might as well get the tent up. Oh, I'm afraid I've never really been one for the outdoors. I shall foot the bill, so let us stay at the caravan over yonder. Now this feels like a road trip. Yeah. Go figure. Huh?
I am still young, my blood is true. As my mother before me, I will work to bring peace to one and all. That marked the ascension of the youngest oracle in history. Is it hard? Morning. Sup. Good morning to you. <clears throat> I should warn you, we're about to pass the point of no return. I trust you're not having any second thoughts. Very well. 